straight away he's like, I feel tired. I feel tired. And we looked at him and he was gray, white lips. We're like, sit down, sit down. So he took a step backwards. We took the guitar off him. He was just like about to pass out. Good morning, everyone. It's time for class. We haven't eaten yet because it is just so hard to get everybody dressed in the dog fed and take him out like three times, get out the door. So I'm gonna see what we can get from the grocery store that we can eat in like 13 minutes and then class. made it this far thank you <laughs> I know that wasn't a very exciting video but what can you do it wasn't a very exciting day to recap really quickly in case you didn't know what was going on we woke up we had an early class we only had about 10 minutes beforehand after dealing with the dog and everything to get a little bit of food in them just so they had energy for class so we ran into the grocery store I got a little container of like mango and mixed berries they shared it they had some water went into class Bastion was still cranky. It's early for him. He's on vacation time still, so he didn't really participate much, but he still had a good time. And then we went straight to the grocery store. We went to Wegmans, so they chose some food, some eggs and fruit and donuts and stuff. We split everything. They had their breakfast, and then... That's a little noisy, sir. I don't think it's supposed to do that. You're supposed to go like this. Push on it. Gently, gently, gently. You're gonna break it. You can put things on it to see how much they weigh. That one weighs orange. Anyway, yeah, so they ate. We went grocery shopping, came home, fed them a light lunch, played with Ziggy, and then Ziggy and Sebastian went up for a nap. I stay with them because Sebastian is super clingy right now. He needs me to hold him the whole time. Uh, after a nap, went downstairs. I forgot to say that right before we left for class, I did a little bit of work, just an edit on that can I was doing. It was a can, the beer can I was doing. And then after a nap, I needed to package it up, like package the files up for the printer. And I came down and Jax and his daddy were playing rock band. Apparently they had just started. But Jax still had his hoodie from us being at the grocery store all zipped up tight and he was playing he was sitting on my spot I was like hey I need to sit down at my computer he scooted over but then Ziggy unplugged his cord because he was stretched too far to sit and so my husband said hey stand up you're supposed to stand up when you play the guitar so he stood up and then right away he's like I feel tired I feel tired and we looked at him and he was gray, white lips. We're like, sit down, sit down. So he took a step backwards. We took the guitar off him. He was just like about to pass out. He's about to faint. He was so clammy and hot. So I took his hoodie off. 
and got him ice water and a fruit bar in case it was blood sugar. I was pretty sure it was blood pressure, like suddenly dropping from him overheating and being sitting there with the blood pooling in his legs as it does when you're overheating and then he suddenly stood up and his blood pressure crashed. That's what my guess is. We checked his temperature, no fever. He did have a cold over vacation, but he's over it. So I think it was just a blood pressure issue. I did have him eat the fruit bar in case he had like some sort of a blood sugar crash, but I don't think so because he's eaten fine today. And yeah, he recovered. Um, he cooled down. He was just overheating. He was really sweaty and, and yucky from having that hoodie zipped all the way up inside the house. He just does that. He just wants to leave things on that are warm. Um, yeah, so he's okay. And not long after that, we went out and had our Taco Tuesday as normal. He was totally fine. Color was all back in his face and back to normal. We talked about it and I made sure to have him take his hoodie off when we got home and he went up to his room to chill. And we got a tiny bit of knitting done tonight. Just, just a tiny bit because the dog was nuts. He just kept running to the doors. And we have to let him out when he runs to the doors because we don't know if he really needs to go. He pees some of the times, but a lot of times he just wanted to eat mulch. It's 49.6. Alright. Anyway, I think I've caught you up. Not an exciting day, but we made it through. Oh, and I started planning Sebastian's birthday party. I need to pick a day. It's kind of a tough time of the year because his birthday's right around when school lets out. If I do it too soon, people are busy with end of school stuff. If I do it too late, they might be on vacation. So I don't know. I might just post on Facebook or something and ask my friends. But yeah, he's gonna have a construction party, which is gonna be a lot of fun. And... Oh, no, my mom is 914. 914, yeah. got it. All right, I'm gonna get this little guy to bed. It's already late, because I, I just, oh, the dog. <laughs> Puppy mode engaged. All right, I'm gonna say goodnight. I don't know what we're doing tomorrow. Maybe we'll go to the thrift store. I don't know, maybe. It depends on what work looks like. So tomorrow, guys. Have a good one. Oh, I talked to her for five minutes.